to make a short update regarding the F-16 I'm probably gonna come next weekend with uh, just a long video uh, just doing stuff uh, but right now I don't have all the materials so uh, I'm still working as you might have seen I uh, started with a main instrument panel and um, oh it's going pretty well so far we have this is just a mock up or it needs to be modified of the uh, armament panel and obviously this is going to be doubled uh, because uh, the clear one on the back is going to be the support for all the switches and buttons this one is going to come in the front and as well uh, what I tend to do uh, I cut it first uh, with the normal one I cut the, the acrylic I spray painted so uh, all these white bits they're going to be all black all the edges and everything and after that I'll put it back in the laser and engrave it so this way you're gonna have a more professional look but with this one uh, I just couldn't be bothered it's just a mock-up just to see if it's sit sit sitting well so uh, that's about it we have the MFDs installed and the screens we have a one uh, I believe it's a 5 inch display for the RWR and this one is uh, on a uh, portrait uh, orientation so this way I'm using the top of the 8 inch uh, IPS high resolution screens I got for this uh, this one in particular I'm using them for the uh, for the standby instrument and the uh, uh, fuel flow counter um, we're working on this section here this is the, the screen is installed it's working it's all set up in, in Helios I'm working on these panels which in the first hand, I've, ju I've just done the blanks, uh, basically the, the acrylic panels, they go on top of everything. And now I'm cutting and engraving the ones that are going to be behind, so just to give uh, a little bit more depth. And well, it, they just look, look better when they're stacked and have some more details underneath. Uh, we're still missing the screen for the HSI. I need to find a maybe five inch display but it's gonna be a um, little bit of an issue with the uh, HDMI ca cable probably I'm gonna run it through the bottom and these two panels are there as well in the laser for printing uh, oh yes ICP so for the ICP I was gonna go with the <coughs> resin printed version uh, unfortunately, the the quality is nice. I like obviously the, uh, the this grill in the middle where you can feel the center of the buttons and uh, it's very helpful. Unfortunately, though, even though I used the really white um, resin, is still not quite there. I, it's not like the white acrylic is is very dull. So um, I think I'm just gonna do it the uh, old style way, way. I'm just gonna cut two pieces of uh, acrylic clear on the back, white on the front, and I'm gonna 3D print this grill in the resin printer and maybe this uh, top button uh, layer here and just apply it on the acrylic. And after that, spray, spray, spray bring everything back and I'll engrave it. Uh, and it's gonna give us this sharp lettering really intense white rather than this um, well it's, it's fine for for uh, dimensions but uh, well that's about it okay so um, the light is not great here let me just turn it this way yeah so uh, we've done the panels, this is what I meant with, you know, panel under the panel, uh, under the transparent one having the one with the white markings, and behind that is the actual panel, so I think this looks slightly, slightly better. Um, yeah, we, we put a couple of switches, just for to get an idea of how uh, you look and uh, 
yeah we're missing the top ones and as well I installed partially installed the the, the HUD um, which is gonna be detachable uh, it's gonna be removable <laughs> yeah so not bad Hey guys, we moved inside. Uh, I wanted to test with the panels on to see how it looks, and to be honest, it looks uh, looks pretty great. Uh, we're still missing, obviously, like I said before, I need to remake the IC uh, ICP from scratch and the armament panel. What I'm gonna probably do now next is uh, finish with the bezels on the RWR and the standby instruments. Um, but uh, yeah good Helios is doing this part really good so yeah that's it for uh, basically part one so um, I'll see you soon and I'll uh, try to next time I'll try to give you more uh, uh, insights of basically just recording while I'm working so that maybe I don't know with might help someone it might not i'm sure there are a lot of people doing uh things 10 times better than me i'm a little bit uh rustic but uh anyways here it is f16 block 50 cockpit